Hi guys, in this Windows Phone Pro video we're going to be looking at Adobe Reader and how it integrates with Internet Explorer. So let's just go ahead and load up uh, whoops, Internet Explorer. Okay, now I have found a uh, website with some links to uh, some PDF files as we can see here. So I've currently downloaded those two files and I want this third one. So all I have to do is tap, and then you see we get this little sort of um, PDF menu here saying, press to open the file, and then we get the uh, file name. So we just tap, and then it will load in um, Adobe Reader. So obviously we've got all our uh, different pages here. We've got uh, Pinch to Zoom, which is very, very fluid, much, uh, more fluid than uh, on the uh, um, on Windows Mobile 6.5 and the HD2. Uh, we've got nice kinetic scrolling, and as we scroll, we get a little page icon up here. If we tap near the bottom, we get our menu. Uh, so there's the about page. We can zoom in as well using buttons. We can also navigate to the different pages. using these buttons here. So I mean it is a very basic reader but um, it does what it's there for. It would be nice if we had uh, proper text wrapping but unfortunately we don't. If we just come out of this a moment and then launch Adobe Reader from the uh, program menu here we can see uh, two PDFs that I've downloaded already so let's just tap on that, and then obviously the uh, PDF loads. We go back, and then we've got our documents. For some strange reason, it didn't save that uh, verb one that we were looking at a minute ago. Okay, so that's the PDF experience on Windows Phone 7. Thanks for watching this video.